Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, um, self-explanatory. Can see is coming out. I don't know, but this is a showcase. So let's react. Vampire legacies. Can see abilities. Wait, he's Volcaros. Sees. Oh, the same thing Bonnie has. Interesting. That would be useful. Okay. Of course she does it to Stefan. Ooh, yes. We want that. A 30 seconds of ability is disabled. That's really good. Huh. It's. Mm, I don't think it's gonna be used. It's cool though, but not gonna be used. Huh. Ooh, I, I can already see combos. This is interesting. I've actually never seen a TV team do this. The vines. Perfectio. This look use, uh, useful though. Ooh, that's that's gonna be really useful. Yeah, that's really, really useful. Wait, how much cooldown does it have? 80 seconds. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's really, that will be really good. <gasps> oh my god, the Vidak study. Hmm. I just want to look at this. This gets here to grasp, uh, causing any mortal to die. And okay, so how long is the desiccation? Is it like forever until they get a blood bag, or is it just like for like? Well, actually, no. It's probably desiccate. Okay. Well, that's yeah. That'll be useful in like hope or something. Let's continue. <laughs> Hey. Oh, that would be really that would be really good for killing heretics and regular vampires. Cause instead you don't want to use like Galphan or something. That could they could just like push or something. This I could see this could be used for killing like heretics. Just throw the the ball on them and then do Atsanam, and then incendia, they're dead. Like, or you just I don't because their siphoners could just siphon it. So like it could also like I'm saying it could be useful, but it can't because like I don't see a time where someone would use this. So. Oh, okay. 
Uh, used to make a lot of her enemies because you can channel ancient magic to create a single cure for immortality. So she creates the cure. But the okay, I love this. We need the cure in the game. The only problem I have with it is that it says it requires a heart, and when it says requires a heart, that's issues for me and for a lot of people. That means I'm gonna have to delphin someone in order to make a cure, which will be challenging because delphin can be like blocked really easily. So I don't know. Let's see it anyway. Cure for immortality. Ooh, that, that looks really good. <gasps> There's another one. There's one. Wait, so she has like, oh, is this like Bonnie, where Bonnie has like her expression abilities that she has to channel the spirits to get? I think this is like the same thing. Okay, as a last resort, Lilith on the other side. Katsia can grab a living player to cross over. Oh, doing this. Oh, so you can basically sacrifice someone to bring yourself back to life. That's gonna be useful. Wait, now that she hold on, there's ten second cooldowns zero magic. I'm like I'm saying that it's only a ten second cooldown. So what if this like basically means that like, Ketsia could be like immortal? Like I don't know. I haven't watched it obviously, but if she doesn't have like an immortality drink that she drinks and she becomes immortal this could be used as a form of immortality so like if she dies she can just latch on to someone and bring her back herself back to life and 10 seconds is nothing like i'm 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 thinking like that Ketsia is not gonna be able to be killed like how unless there's like no one in the server but there's obviously gonna be people in the server it's like i just don't understand any way that she couldn't be immortal from this Heavy damage and knocking them unconscious. You know, I'm just gonna see it. I, I'm just judging. I haven't even seen it yet. Let's just watch. As I pass through you, I feel my death. Sorry. Huh? Wait, I'm so confused now. Monsters are at Willis on the other side. Hold up. Hold up, I'm so confused. I'm so confused, like now that I've watched it. I'm so confused now. So she latches on to the life of someone, but it says to cross over to the afterlife. So does this mean that like, but as a last resort, what do you mean last resort? Like, is this how like she passes over to like die or something? I'm so confused. Or maybe she has to do this to get over to the afterlife, and that's how she resurrects herself. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. This is so confusing. Now. As I pass through you, I feel my death. Sorry. Because look, it literally like it like she goes away. Like she doesn't get resurrected. She doesn't. Like... As creator of the side, Cassia can pull herself back once per lifetime. Huh. <gasps> she could take down the other side. Oh my god. Allows Cassia to take down the other side when casting any spirits. 
Resident on the other side will be sucked into a void and sent back to the main menu. Ooh, it's 300 second cooldown? A bit much. I would say like 100 seconds, but this is really good. I don't know why the anchor spell is happening there, but okay. Eight. Wait, is that it? Is that it? I'm so confused now. Hold up, let's go back here. Let's go back. I'm so confused. Is that it? Knife spell, stone spell, brain fry. I'm so confused. Is that it? That's it? Like, what? gonna be more spiritual let's look at this again as I pass through you you'll feel my death sorry I, I honestly don't know what this is I don't know what it does it, there is a, like a, a thing here but like I'm so confused because when she's on the other side it looks like that she resurrects herself from her body so like, is this, like, maybe Ketsia can't move on when she dies. So she can either resurrect herself, which is once, and then after that, she could stay on the other side forever until she moves on through the course of someone else's body. This is a theory. I don't know. Um, let's just look at Cure Creation one more time. I'm just going to, you know, let's go through all of them again. I want to look through these again. Manasef Nyes into reality until I can launch them. I don't see a point of this, but could be useful. Yes, I, I like this. But obviously she's a Bennett, of course, like Bonnie has this too. is for you guys it might be like really like but um in my opinion the only thing i like from this is that it strips their memories i don't know how much damage it does but obviously the 30 seconds of ability disabled is really good this i don't see ah! anyone Ever. Ever. Unless just like a quick second to burn the enemy on the ground, but who you knows? <laughs> this I can see be really good for combos. In this photo, it just looks like it pushes them away and preventing anyone from getting near her. When I first looked at this, I thought it would be like the Freya from TBO thing. It circles around, 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 damaging them. But from this, now that I rewatched it, it looks like that. It's just like a push. And it per it's like a wall of fire that pre prevents someone from coming near her. That's what it looks like. I see this could be useful for getting people away from her. Now this looks like it lasts a while. So this could be really useful if you wanted to run away from someone as like their like restraint for a bit. This I find amazing the regen of the magic and they still haven't added channeling yet so they might add it uh. Uh. 
Sin and Uncorpus. As I said, um, it's not, this won't probably be useful at all. Okay, now this I find great, but the heart is not great at all. The animation ate up. Best animation. One of their best animations. A cure for immortality. Now, to be honest, I think that they should have repurposed this animation. Instead of making the cure, I think they could have, um use this to make an immortality drink for Ketsia, but I understand like, um, some games don't want Ketsia to be immortal, but that's understandable, but ju I'm just saying that most TDD games have Ketsia make an immortality drink um to make herself immortal, but um, this is great too, it's just I think that the animation would have been better from my point of view to do a immortality drink instead of the cure. Like the cure could have been her holding up her hand in the air, maybe a lightning bolt hits it, makes the cure, or it could have been like a, a huge thing that you have to sacrifice one person to make the cure, maybe another heart, but like... I'm just saying a heart for the cure isn't really that it. Like, I could understand if it was for the immortality elixir, but it's for the cure, which doesn't make much sense to me. Now, if the cure could cure hope at full health, it would be really good. But in most instances, it's probably going to only be able to reverse her once it's under, like, 150 or 100, because these games are trying to make things balanced. But the community which is me and other people, want it to be better. But I'm just saying, TVL, if you're watching this video, you did amazing. She ate, she slayed, she's good. Just, in, I think in other apps, aspects, you could have made her better. Like, if, if, if I was the owner, like, no, this is like, if I, if I was doing this, I would have added, like, an extra ability or two and made it, like, her to have three self-resurrections on the other side instead of just one. I don't really understand the other side holding on to someone to pass through them. I don't understand. Unless, if Ketsuya can be on the other side forever until she moves on through one person, that would be too overpowered because a Ketsuya would just sit on the other side forever. So it doesn't make much sense to me. But, you know, TVL, you do you. You do you. you you're, you're doing so much by making the characters individual. Um, I don't even know what the next one is. Hope it's Esther. But, you know, I'm just saying that, um, you ate. But, you know, other aspects. I still don't understand this. And we've been here for ten minutes. It As I pass through you, I feel my death. Sorry. Still doesn't make sense. Now this once per life seems too little. Should be three times. In the applause calls Yajem I for Dage Rasakan. Okay, another thing I'm gonna say is that the other side destruction, destruction, sh this animation should have been used to make someone an anchor. Like, every single time someone dies, the death passes through them, maybe they lose a little health. And then once enough deaths pass through them, maybe they could be weakened. Like, if you did on Hope, for example, she could be, like weak enough to the point where you can like delve in her and she'll die but like i'm just saying that this animation is good really good i just think that it shouldn't have been used to make the other side like disrupt it should have been used to make the the anchor and it literally has the anchor voice line and the anchor pentagram because that's literally the same one that she used in the show for the anchor but instead she they decided to do other side take down 
or they should have been that you take down the whole other side uh, and you get this list of people that are on the other side and you can pick one of them from the list who resurrect to be an anchor. That would have been another good thing. So you destroy everyone on the other side except that one person. You bring them back to life and then throw the anchor. And then, as I said, the anchor system. So I'm just saying that other things could be improved or reworked to the point where they could be better. Let's look at this again. It just doesn't make sense to me why this is other side destruction. doesn't make much sense to me but anyway um this um gets the uh, showcase eight there is a couple things i said that should have been improved on Estima estimated release date for me uh, i think she might come out tomorrow or the day after because when bonnie the showcase came out she came out the next day and everyone was staying up because i i i had like five of my staff and I stay up until like six in the morning. The and we were all thinking Bonnie was gonna come out at like twelve. We all thought that she was gonna come out, but no. Of course, they planned a release date and they released her. So they like they they announced the same day when she was coming out. I think she came out the day or or the day after. But you know, I'm just saying anything could happen. She could come out tomorrow or the next day or the next day next week maybe. I don't know. Uh, thank you guys for watching this Ketsia Showcase. She ate. Uh, go check out TVL2. Join my Discord. Yeah, have a great day, guys. Goodbye.